All right, so in this video, I want to talk about learning to be patient. And this is something that a lot of poker players struggle with, especially students that come to me and take my course. They struggle with being patient. So what does that mean? Well, number one, be patient with your learning experience. Don't expect to skim through maybe 25% of this course, then start to play online and expect to win a lot of money. And we're going to talk about having realistic expectations in another video. So I want to make sure I don't really dive into that. Uh, number two is that in regards to poker and variance and our expected results, we can see all sorts of things over the short run. We could be running really bad or we could be playing really bad and our results could be very poor. But in the short run, we don't really want to take a look at those results and assume the worst. We want to give ourselves some time. So be patient with your results as well. And again, I want to talk a bit more about that in regards to having realistic expectations later in this section. Now, another thing is being patient at the table. So I have a lot of students that they just don't like the slow pace of the game playing one table of a regular speed game. So what they'll do is they'll jump into fast world poker such as snap poker on 88 or zoom on poker stars or zone on bovada or ignition and they'll have all sorts of issues in their game because they're really not prepared to play that fast paced of a game because if you don't have the skill set if you don't have the knowledge to be able to make optimal decisions in about 10 or 15 seconds you shouldn't be playing those games so what i want you to do is take a step back be patient and you really don't even have to jump into the games and start playing right off i'll give you an example when i got back into poker what i did is literally for a month I sat down and just studied the game. I signed up for poker training sites. I watched poker training videos. I watched a bunch of theory lecture type courses like this. And I took notes and I just studied the game. In about a month's time, I felt like I was prepared. Then I started to play the game. Now we're all different, but that's just an example. I just want you to understand that you need to be patient with your game. And if you're struggling, let's say that you're break even or you're mildly losing after 5,000 hands or 10,000 hands or even 15,000 hands, don't worry. Give it some time. Be patient with your game. Don't expect to be a crusher. Don't expect to go from 2 and L up to 50 and L or maybe 100 and L in three months. Don't expect to be a crusher, right? You want to be patient and you want to have realistic expectations. And I'll talk about that a bit more in another video in this section. So that's just the basic concept of being patient. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys at the next video.